Hi guys, my name is Ramiz Atik and I hope you're all doing very well. Many of you have requested that I show you what my average day looks like, so let's go. I just wanted to say thank you all so much for the love and support. It really means a lot to me. Every single day is the same. I come downstairs, I go to the reception and I ask them to order a taxi for me because my app doesn't work and it's actually become comical now. Every time I come downstairs, the hotel staff just laugh at me and say, oh, I may as well get the LinkedIn profile out of the way. So I've been following MMA for about 15 years and I train in wrestling, Muay Thai and BJJ myself. In terms of education, I have a bachelor's degree in English, a master's degree in English language teaching, and I also have a CELTA certificate. I've been teaching for seven years now. I started working in the UK teaching Key Stage 3 GCSE and I worked in a language center teaching English as a second language to mostly European students. After that, I taught for one year abroad in the beautiful city of Medina and then I decided to come back to the UK to pursue a master's degree and that's where I got involved in teaching English for academic purposes, working at universities. I've been in and out of China since 2015. So I do mostly project work in China, contracting on behalf of universities, teaching academic English, and also managing academic programs. So this is my third time in Beijing. I've mostly worked in Beijing and I've spent a little bit of time in Guangzhou. So I'm sure you are all curious as to how I met Wei Li. So I'll tell you. I actually saw Wei Li at the meet and greet and I wanted to speak to her but it was so busy and I thought it's not fair if I stand here for 5-10 minutes speaking to her about what I want to do. So I ended up just saying hello and leaving. And then after the Khabib and Poirier event, I think a couple of days later, I met her in the mall and she was having lunch with her team. And I said to my wife, I said, that's it. I have to go and speak to her. So I went up to the team and I said, I'm an English teacher. I want to teach Whaley. And at the beginning, they were a bit confused. Okay, who are you? And next thing you know, we end up spending half an hour together. I think we just clicked. Within two days, they got back to me and they said, Let's start. So at the time I had a couple of commitments. So I said to Whaley and her team, why don't we start off with some online lessons? So I spent about, I think five or six weeks teaching her online, mostly doing pronunciation work. And then I got to Beijing around mid-November. Yeah, so that's it. How are you, coach? I'm fine. I'm really good. <laughs> are you tired? Uh, no. Uh, tonight, uh, sleep a little bit. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, me? Uh, come. Go home, no key. Uh, oh. I call. This, this. No, no oven. No oven. No oven. Was was he sleeping as well? Yes, sleep. Oh. He sleep. So how did you get into the house? Uh. How how did you get inside? It's oh it's. Yes. You climbed in. Yeah. Yeah. Behind there is a low key. How are you, coach? Hello. I will get you back on FIFA. <laughs> FIFA. Let's go. FIFA champion. Destroyed me on FIFA. With England as well. Uh, TB12. Uh, my Japanese fans uh, give me. Yeah. 
Wow. Tataki Matsuda. Tataki Matsuda. Uh, we, my friends, uh, old friend, friend. <laughs> Hallelujah. How are you, we? I'm pretty good. This is what? We just finished the training this morning with Wei Li. And yeah, here is the, it's the foam roller from uh, my trainer in uh, Boston. Tataki Matsuda. Thank you. How are you, Poppy? Good. Good. How are you? How are you? No. 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 He's too strong. Summer. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. How's your business? Okay. You study English, your business is very good, you know. <laughs> Coach. Yes. What are we going to eat? Uh, this. What is this? Uh, Tang Hulu. Tang Hulu, what's it called? Tang Hulu. I don't know. Sugar Hulu. It's very tough to translate this one. I don't even know how to do that. It's just kind of, uh, I don't even know what's it. It's a kind of a... Thank you, thank you. It's kind of a fruit, uh, the right one. But I don't know the English name of that one. And some, uh, they have made some sugar outside that one to make it cracky and very tasty. A little sour and uh, very sweet together. It's a combination of different flavors. Yeah. How is it? Delicious. Shanyao. Shanyao dou. Look in the dictionary. Look it up. Okay, so this is actually a nice surprise. I wasn't expecting to eat a hot pot. Okay guys, so we just got back to the house. We had an incredible lunch. Now everyone is going to take a nap at this time. I normally do a bit of work or some editing, but uh, because I've been training for the last two days, I'm going to 
pray and then I'm going to take a little nap myself. See you in a bit. Hello. How are you? Fine. How do you feel? Mm, very good. A little tired, a little tired. Your phone have uh, you got, uh, a message. Yeah, a message. This? Yes. Uh, yeah. All right. Oh, okay. Give you. Yes. Uh, computer. Computer. Run. Uh, change. Uh. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. No problem. No problem. Let's do it now. We see each other again, Victor. Yeah. <laughs> So I've just finished everyone's visa application. What did you do today? Uh, today technique uh, training finish. Uh, later go dinner. I'm, I'm a friend. I'm a manager. So we were invited to some fancy restaurant and I really wanted to film the dinner but there were 15 other people there I didn't know. So I didn't feel very comfortable filming random people. Anyway, um, I'm ready for bed. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. And if you didn't like the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. So that's it from me guys. Until next time, God bless.